I'm Lytle Thomas, President and Chief Executive Officer of Heritage Bank. I'm Lytle Thomas, President and Chief Executive Officer of Heritage Bank. Heritage Bank was founded in 1990 by a group of local business people in Northern Kentucky, and the bank really was chartered and set up to cater to small business and consumer uh, banking needs here in the North Kentucky area. The original founders had really thought there'd be a couple of branches to serve friends and neighbors in the Burlington and Florence community. Uh, but here, 27 years later, we have 17 offices and an operations center, over 170 employees, and over 500 million in assets. Heritage Bank was founded in 1990 by a group of local business people who wanted to have a local financial institution to serve their friends and neighbors. They thought originally there'd be a couple of offices in Burlington and Florence, but today we serve all of Northern Kentucky in five counties with 17 offices and one operations center. Fantastic. Which bank phased as it grew? Let me go back to that last one because I didn't put the numbers in the second time. Okay. So let me, let's, sure. let's do that one more time if you could ask that. Yeah, uh, if you would tell me a little bit about <clears throat> Heritage Bank, please. Heritage Bank was founded in 1990 by a group of local business people here in Northern Kentucky. The bank today serves five counties with 17 offices and over 700 million in asset size. We have 170 employees taking care of our local business and consumer customers here in Northern Kentucky. So Heritage Bank has been around for 27 years and you can imagine in 27 years there's been substantial changes in information technology. Uh, that obviously has, has been coming at the bank from two factors. One is the change in the technology and the second is the growth in our bank. We have the same person in-house serving our IT needs today, but obviously the scope of what he's able to do has changed dramatically. So we had to reach out and bring NetGain in to assist us with the extended coverage of all the things IT related in our bank. Okay, fantastic. You know, we've faced a number of challenges as we've continued to grow our bank in the face of dramatic change and revolutionary change in information security. One of those changes obviously has been in cybersecurity, uh, communications. Um, we needed to reach out and find experts who could come to us with solutions and ideas to help address the ever-changing needs that we have at our bank. NetGain has been able to do that for us. They have teams of engineers who have come in and put projects in place to help assist us with growing our bank and making sure we did it in a safe and sound manner for our customers. Excellent. That's very good. Uh, you had some pretty dire problems. Okay. So as I had, uh, well, let me, let me see how to answer this. Obviously, with all of the changes taking place in the world today, Information technology is absolutely critical to so many fundamental parts of the bank. It, the safety and security of our shareholders, the financial interests of our owners, obviously the ability for our employees to communicate and to take care of customers in the right way, and keeping all of this safe and sound for all those parties involved. The pace of that change and the growth of our bank has really caused great challenges challenges that would have been very difficult to meet if we had not had an outside source to come in and assist us, give us best practices, industry expectations, guidance on what examiners want to see when they come to the bank. NetGain has provided that to us in many, many different ways. They've done a great job in partnering with our in-house people, as well as providing us the best methodology to address the needs that we had. Initially, we weren't sure what we were looking for with a managed service partner. We knew we had additional requirements of our IT capabilities, but we weren't exactly sure what those were. NetGain was able to come to us with an outline that helped us to understand what we needed and why we needed it. In addition, they helped us to implement those things so that we provide a better network within our bank to take care of our customers and our investors. I think I am like many bankers, I know banking. I know how to take care of customers and do loans and talk through financial matters. But information technology is outside that world in, a many, in many, many ways. 
I had to have experts come in and help educate me and direct some of the thinking process that we have in our strategic planning, especially as it related to information technology within the bank. We know we need management reporting. We know we need communications. We know cybersecurity is a huge issue. We know we have continued increase in requirements for our IT exams and the requirements of customers and just internal workings of the bank. In addition to all those things, we have had a bank that's had substantial growth. So we needed to address these things in an aggressive manner. We went out and hired NetGain to come in and help us with each and every one of those. And they've done a great job in helping us through all of the challenges that we've brought before them. They've seen it, they've done it, they've been there, and they provided great advice to us. So we have seen a number of areas of dramatic change in our bank as a result of managed services on the IT side. Uh, first of all, our customers now have a help desk to call rather than one person in the bank trying to address 170 employees uh, who can't log in that morning. Whatever that issue may be, the managed services provides uh, just a, a blanket of coverage to us 24-7 uh, to address needs of our employees getting into the computer systems. The other area that has been of tremendous help is in things that bankers not typically are in tune with, things like backup servers, uh, redundancy, uh, the capacity to pull your system back up in a, in a uh, traumatic failure. Uh, so we've been able to implement a number of projects to address significant issues the bank uh, needed to address in terms of safety and soundness of our information and the ability for the bank to recover in any situation that may be thrown at us. We could not have done that without uh, assistance in all of those projects that we brought on. Okay, excellent. Refer to managed IT services. Yeah. So managed IT services did have impact to our bank. The good news is there was no impact to our customers. That has been seamless to them throughout the entire process, which is the best case scenario. As far as our employees, they now have a 24-7 helpline they can call if it's a lost password or forgot how to log in or need to get some assistance with something in our systems. That has been a tremendous resource where before we had one internal employee to help other employees, now we have a help desk that can help at any time. So that has been a tremendous resource for us. The second part is that we have been able to bring in system engineers to help us design and put in place processes and systems for things like backup coverage or emergency recovery. Those are things that would have been very difficult for a banker to figure out, but we've been blessed with a resource manager that came in with system engineers who could design that for us using best in industry design and best in industry equipment to comp accomplish those goals. Hopefully that addressed it a little better. You did. Yeah, you did okay. a great job with that. So, um, you know, we, we uh, hear that uh, did a change in audit results or audit, audit comments. Yeah, okay, I can speak to that. So we recently, just very recently, have gone through a, an IT FDIC exam. And this was the first time under the new criteria that the FDIC have put in place for the examination process uh, as it relates to IT specifically. And I can tell you we were very, very pleased with the comments on this FDIC exam, especially the first time through this new exam process. Uh, we had obviously prepared for that. We had talked with our net gain uh, system engineers. We made sure that we had things buttoned up uh, well before the exam ever came in. When the examiners were here, they were very pleased to see what had been accomplished, uh, the process that we had put in place, and the direction that we were moving the bank. All of those things were accomplished with great assistance from net gain technologies. So if you were speaking with uh, hybrid like Heritage Bank has, what are some of the factors that, that uh, you might counsel fellow uh, bank leaders yeah. to look at? Okay. Moving to a outside provider for IT solutions within our bank was not an easy decision. Obviously, we had to look at 
numerous different providers. We had to look at the cost associated with a managed service. It's not cheap to have state-of-the-art information technology services. At, at the end of the day, our decision was based on what was best for the long-term safety and soundness of our bank, what was best for pr protection of the vital information that we hold within our bank on our customers, and what was best for our employees to be able to come in and be effective in their jobs every day with systems that supported what they needed to get done. When we boiled that all down, our conclusion was that NetGain was the best service provider for us. They brought experience. They brought 72 system engineers that they had at the time we signed up with them. I could not have afforded to hire 72 system engineers. They already had them on staff available to us, regardless of what type of technology problem we were trying to solve. They'd been there, they'd done it, they did a great job every time we have asked them uh, for follow-up. Uh, we, we have just been very, very pleased with NetGain and all that they've brought to the table for us. Excellent. Okay, so uh, speaking uh, specifically about uh, have they helped with uh, budget forecasting for IT within the bank? Sure, I can, I can speak to that. So one of the things that's been brought to the table that I hadn't really anticipated at the time we signed up was just the ongoing process of considering what IT solutions we need within the bank. That not only is the monthly reporting, the quarterly follow-up, the reporting to our board of directors, uh, we do those things not because we have to as part of the exam, but because it's best business practice. What NetGain brings to us are solutions, opportunities, uh, future thinking that they have seen and experienced at banks of all sizes in all different conditions. They bring to us best practices in the industry. In addition to that, they're endorsed by the Kentucky Bankers Association, so we know that they carry that flag or that seal of approval uh, in addition to all else that they do. For us, it has certainly been the best solution possible. Excellent. Either systems or a system-wide outage since dealing with net gain. Not yeah. really a loaded question. If, yeah, you know. we really had not experienced downtime uh, in our systems prior to NetGain becoming involved. I will say what we have experienced is the capacity to, I mean, we have, we have tripled the size of our bank in the last six years. So for us to be able to have that growth scale and to experience that growth with no downtime, uh, no password reset issues, uh, no customer facing problems uh, is, is a significant win for Heritage Bank. And that was only accomplished by forward thinking, uh, by proactive activities, by process, procedure, planning, all of which NetGain has assisted us in. Excellent. Heritage Bank, continue to grow. Oh, I. I think NetGain has certainly provided to us everything we have needed to grow our bank. We continue to experience growth. We sit down on a quarterly basis, uh, actually now on a monthly basis with our NetGain uh, representative. Uh, in those meetings, we talk about needs, we talk about future, what we're going to be, what we need to have to accomplish the things we need to accomplish. That's the sort of teamwork and interactive uh, communication that any growing organization needs, and it has been very, very effective for us. Very good. Technology. So anytime you make changes, people are going to complain. And I think that's true in anything in life. Bringing in a managed service provider for password resets, something as simple as password resets, uh, is, a, is a major change for people's day to day. I, as CEO of the bank, hear all of the complaints. I'm here to solve issues, solve problems. But in that process, I heard very, very few complaints about people who were calling to have their passwords reset or calling to have help uh, with whatever their issue was. The service level uh, from NetGain and from the, from the call center there has been tremendous for our people. They adapted to that good change very, very quickly. So we had no issues in that transition from internal to external in our help desk function. Excellent. 
As with most banks, we certainly did a search for the best service provider for Heritage Bank in, in these managed solution providers. For, for us, NetGain was the best solution for a number of reasons. It's a family-owned business. Uh, we're a family-owned bank. We tip, tend to cater to family-owned businesses, so that was very important to us. They are a Kentucky-based solution, and we obviously are proud Kentuckians. They're an endorsed member of the Kentucky Bankers Association, which again carries a seal of approval that's very, very important to our bank. Beyond all those, though, they also work with a number of different banks in different states, different sizes, and that brings a diversity of thought, uh, of forethought and, and planning to us that was not available with many of the competition who don't work with banks. Banks are unique, and the criteria that we have to operate under because of government regulation is very, very important to us. That is ever-changing, and NetGain has helped us stay ahead of the curve to make sure we're doing everything we need to do to protect our assets here within the bank. Excellent. I'm going to go over the same question again. I love the response. I love the Kentucky Bay NetGain Technologies, your choice for managed services. NetGain was the perfect provider for our bank because we're a family-owned bank and they're a family-owned business. When we met with Brendan and Jason, the owners of the company, uh, and they met with the owners of the bank, there was a chemistry that existed there because both had interest of shareholders, interest of family, interest of customer service, first and foremost in their mind. That helped our decision quite a bit. In addition to family-owned, they operate within multiple states and they work with many, many banks. And the, the ability for them to bring to us best solutions, best ideas that they see out in the industry is very important for our bank. Sorry. Would you recommend NetGain Technologies to other banks seeking uh, IT services? Whenever possible, I try to share with fellow bankers what has worked well for Heritage Bank. I can tell you the outsourcing of these managed services to NetGain has been a tremendous benefit to Heritage Bank. I certainly would recommend any Kentucky bank look at that. Uh, well, let me start over again. NetGain Technologies has provided tremendous solutions to Heritage Bank. It's a service that we badly needed, we have certainly used extensively, and we will continue to use in the future. I would recommend managed services for IT solutions for any bank that's growing or plans on growing. I certainly would recommend NetGain Technologies. They've done great work for our bank, and we look for this to be a partnership for a long time to come. I'm Lytle Thomas, President and Chief Executive Officer of Heritage Bank, and I would recommend for any bank that's growing, that's addressing technology concerns, look outside to a third-party provider of managed services. I highly recommend NetGain Technologies for service specifically to the banking industry, but bigger than that, to bring expertise on IT managed solutions to your bank. Does that work? Was there anything? I don't want to take up more than Oh, no, time. you guys are fine on time. Sure I'm good. Okay. Uh, was there anything that we covered that uh, you think that you would like to do again, have me ask a question in a different way? I don't know. You guys are the professionals here. You tell me. Yeah. I mean, I thought it sounded good. I think we've got a lot of stuff. A lot of really. Yeah. It was very concise. You restated okay. most of your questions. Yeah. Okay. I feel, I feel really good about it. Okay. It sounded phenomenal. So okay, good. Had no loud cars. Yeah, <laughs> no ambulances or fire trucks, that's always good. Okay. You've clearly done this before.